Hey, what's up, everybody? I'm Brock with PDQ. Have you tried turning it off and on again? How many times have you heard that? How many times have you asked that? If you asked it a lot, well, you're probably a sysadmin. But is there really a difference? How do you do it? Do you use shutdown or do you use restart? Do you have a preference? Personally, I've always used shutdown because, well, I thought that it was probably the better method of doing it. Shut down your system, you know, wait a few seconds, or in my case, stare at my phone for like 20 minutes and then decide to turn my computer back on. And I figured that gave it plenty of time to do its thing, restart, come back up, refresh, and get some work done. Turns out that may not have been correct. So after doing some research, it looks like restart should be your go-to for rebooting your computer. And not just because it brings your computer back up for you. Uh, you see, in Windows 8, at least as far as I can tell, in Windows 8, a feature was added called Fast Startup. And Fast Startup only is applied when using the shutdown option to turn off your computer. So what Fast Startup does is it kind of puts your computer into a hybrid hibernation state. It saves your system's kernel state to your hyperfill file, which then as you turn your computer back on, it loads that information so your computer boots quicker. However, if you're, say, troubleshooting, maybe installing some updates or wanting to apply group policies, those things may not be applied if that kernel state is saved. Should you restart or shut down? Well, honestly, you should probably restart just because that will eliminate any of those chances you have of that kernel state having an issue with it and it being reloaded with those same issues still present. There is a, a, a little secret I learned. If you've been around Windows systems long enough, you know that holding down the shift key can give you some additional options in Windows. It turns out if you hold down the shift key while turning off your computer using shutdown, it'll actually shut down the computer without using that fast startup feature. So just a little helpful tip there. Next time you go to reboot your computer, think about it. Do you want to shut down or restart? I know personally, I'm going to be using restart a lot more often just because it'll eliminate any of those potential issues that fast startup might introduce to the process. Anyways, make sure to like and subscribe, guys. If you've got any questions about the process, leave them down below. With PDQ, I'm Brock.